Welcome to part two of the Contact 3 tutorial videos. In a previous tutorial, we saw how to find sounds quickly. Now let's take a look at how to load and play them. Loading a sound in the Contact 3 is quite easy. Simply navigate to the desired folder in the file browser or database and drag and drop it into the Contact 3 rack. Alternatively, a file can be double-clicked and it will be loaded into the first available space in the rack. You can also forego the browser altogether and use the Quick Load menu at the top of the contact interface to directly access the instrument you want. If you decide you don't like a particular instrument and want to load another one in the same slot, you don't need to delete it and reload another one. You can use the Quick Load menu embedded directly in the instrument itself to select another choice. You can also drag an instrument from the database or file browser and drop it on top of the unwanted instrument and it will be replaced. You can also use the left-right arrows on the instrument rack to advance to the next sound in the current folder. This allows you to quickly audition sounds within a particular category without any interaction with the file structure. Each instrument in the Contact 3 rack can respond to a unique MIDI channel. This is ideal for creating a multi-timbral instance of contact in a sequencer, for example, where each MIDI track plays a different contact sound. The MIDI channel can be changed via a drop-down menu directly on the instrument rack. When loading several instruments one after the other, Contact will automatically give each instrument the next MIDI channel number in the series for easy multi timbral operation. This will happen regardless of the method used to load the instrument. In addition to MIDI channel, each instrument in Contact 3 can address a particular audio channel in the Contact Mixer, allowing you to create instrument submixes or apply effects to several instruments at once. The desired audio channel is selected via a convenient drop-down menu. A given channel in the Contact 3 mixer can then be bussed directly to a desired output on your sound card, or to a virtual output in your sequencer host when running Contact 3 as a plug-in. Loading and playing sounds in Contact 3 is fast and easy. Be sure to check out the next video tutorial if you'd like to see some of the effects that come bundled with Contact 3.